Hi, today we are gonna go through the Warrior Series flow. So let's just get started. All right, if you wanna step forward to the front of your mat, I'd like you to go ahead and step back with your right foot, okay? And when you step back with your right foot, you are going to watch and make sure that your left heel is aligned with your right arch. Okay, that's one option for this pose. The second option is the lunge foot position, which is like this. And you can choose either, it's up to you, whatever's more comfortable. I like, I like the heel aligned with the arch. So inhale, arms coming up, okay? What we're doing here is we're squaring the shoulders and we're squaring the hips to the front wall. Strong legs here. As we constantly adjust our posture, staying in the now. Good. Breathing. That's good. So now we hold this for about 12 breaths. Making sure that our knee stays behind our ankle to keep us safe. Pressing in the back into that outer foot. If you're in the lunge position, you're pressing your heel down toward the mat. Good. Squaring the hips and shoulders. So now inhale, reach. Exhale. Arms coming down into warrior two. Your hips and shoulders, this is the difference, your hips and shoulders are now square to the side wall. So go ahead and just feel that. Feel your hips, square them to the side wall. Square your shoulders to the side wall. Relax your shoulders. And our gaze stays the same, out over our left arm. Adjust your feet as you need to. And then just breathe. Good. Constantly adjusting, making sure that your shoulders are relaxed. Breath is moving, flowing. Good. Now we're going to inhale, extend our arms outward toward the walls. Exhale, reverse warrior. Your hand can come to your thigh here. It can rest on your thigh, not on your knee, but on your thigh. Left arm to the sky and the gaze follows. Now you can do one of two things with this pose. You can stay here. Or you can bring your hand and wrap it around your left thigh for a greater stretch. It's up to you. Keep yourself safe. And just breathe. Watch that the knee is still behind the ankle and the toes. Good. Pressing into that outer foot in the back there on the right. Good. Breathing. About 12 breaths. So inhale now, reach. Exhale, windmilling the arms. Left arm comes down toward the mat or onto the knee. It can rest right here on the knee or it can come down to the mat. Gaze is up above with the right arm. That's right. And just hold this and breathe.
Good. A lot of energy in that left leg now since we're at the end of this series. On an inhale now, coming up, exhale into five-pointed star. Good. And just relax here in this posture for a second. As we relax and feel the energy in five directions here, I'm going to tell you a little bit about what's coming up. More yoga, of course, and also coming up, We've got the 52 weeks, I'm calling it a book club, because I want your comments, I want your feedback on the book. The book is called 52 Weeks, and we're going to explore it. It's 52 quotes, one for each week of the year, and we're going to go through the whole year with it. It's a fantastic way to alter your perceptions. Hope you will join me in that. Go ahead and watch the 52 Weeks trailer if you're interested. I would love for you to join me. It's going to start in January. Now, for the second portion of our warrior flow here, I'm going to grab my weights. Um, I'm going to show you how I do this flow in the mornings with my weights. Okay? I use 10 pounds now. I started out with smaller weights. You might want to start out with two or five, whatever is comfortable for you because we're going to be holding these above our heads. So step to the front of your mat and grab your weights if you have them. And then we're going to step back with our left foot. Actually, I'm going to switch directions here so that I'm facing you in these postures. Stepping back with the left foot, minding the heel to the arch, good. And then on an inhale, we're gonna raise the arms up, squaring the hips and shoulders now, watching the knee, relaxing the shoulders. That's good. And breathe. Breathing here. Breathing is so important in yoga. We're breathing out all the stress, all the tension. We're breathing out all the toxins. A bit more of a challenge with the weights, but it's really good for your arms. Adjusting the posture. Just keep adjusting. Paying attention. Paying attention to what we're doing right now. Inhale, stretching. Exhaling, down into warrior two. We're just holding this as best we can. Our arms may or may not extend fully. Hips and shoulders are now square to the front wall. As we breathe. We're really needing this breath now to hold this posture. Getting ready for reverse warrior. Inhale. And on an exhale, right arm comes up. Left arm can rest on the thigh. Or you can bring it around for the wrap and rest the weight on the right thigh. It's up to you. Whatever's comfortable, just stay safe. Gaze is skyward. Good. This posture feels good. It stretches the spine. Breathing.
about 12 breaths. Inhale, stretch now. And exhale, coming down. Left arm skyward and the gaze follows. Right arm to the floor. And what I do here is I do some arm pumps with the right arm and the left arm when I'm in the other side. So let's take it like this. However many you want. Breathe. Adjusting is necessary. Good. Inhale, coming up, strong arms. Okay, the next thing we're gonna do is we're going to, we're gonna take care of those flabby 40s. You know, the little flabby you get under your arms as you get a little older. We're gonna take care of that right now. So, what we're gonna do here, we're gonna be in a five-pointed star position. We're gonna bend our knees slightly now mind your spine here. We're not gonna use the arch position. I always have to check that. I have a tendency to arch. We're gonna keep the spine straight, okay? And we're gonna bend the knees. Uh, toes are pointed outward, but they feel slightly inward. Okay, so then we're gonna raise the arms up overhead. And like I said, start with the two pounders and see how they work. And then gradually, increase the amount of weight that you'd like. So what I do here is I alternate arms first and I do about 24. Breathe, watching the spine. I just had to adjust mine. Keep the stomach muscles tight. The core is tight here. This is also an exercise for the core. And I don't know what number we're on, so I'm just gonna guess for about when I get to 24. Breathe. Can feel that 40s flab just melting away. All right, so arms up now. And we're gonna do one more exercise here. We're gonna bring the arms down together this time. And then we're gonna bend our knees down and up as we bend our arms. So one, two, and about 12 of these. Good. Breathe. Watch that core, keep it tight. Keep the spine straight. Good job. Excellent. Coming down now, stepping in. Go ahead and put the weights down. Excellent. So that was the Warrior Series. Join me for more yoga. I look forward to seeing you. If you like it, like it, share it, and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. And namaste.